On the last episode of Subnautica Below Zero, I wanted to show off my new base. So I took the first part of the episode to conduct my own personal MTV Cribs episode, except less glamour and more trash cans. We then hunky dorried around a bunch of icebergs trying to find Marguerite's base. After finally founding her, she gave us a little bit of information, but not a whole lot to go on. But I did steal some plants from her to start my own indoor grow bed. Let's get in there. What's up everyone, Derek KS here, and welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. We've got a couple big things we're going to do today. So first off, I'd really like to make a greenhouse for my base. I know we have a lot of things going on story-wise, but I, I wanna start off by making a greenhouse for my base. And unfortunately, I'm looking a little slim on titanium and quartz. So we're gonna go down and get some titanium first off, and then get some quartz after that. After that, we're gonna go down and we're gonna poke the Shadow Leviathan a little bit and see if we can get to the next body part for good old boy, Alan. Uh, to get the titanium, we're gonna go down to the mine like how I showed in the tutorial that I made for it. It's a really good place to get titanium if you missed it. It's really quick, easy, and, and I mean, I think offhand in the video, I counted a hundred titanium you could get and I missed a couple of nodes and counting. And so there's at least, at least 120 titanium down there, which is pretty sweet. Okay, we're just gonna, we're gonna, we're just going head straight down. So if you, if you did miss that guide, uh, you can, you can literally get down to the mine by just going down holes over here. All you gotta do is go over by the Delta station and just keep dropping down. Pretty quick and easy to get to, honestly. And I, I wish I would have done this when I was making my base. It would, it would have made it so much easier to get titanium if I would have done it this way. But I did it after the fact, because I was like, there's gotta be an easier way to get titanium. <laughs> and I was right, there it is. Okay, let's get to mining. Okay, and in six minutes, <laughs> in six minutes, we got all this titanium. So uh, it's rose by six, one, two, three, four, five, six. So I got 36 over here. And then these rows are six. So one, two, three, four, um, hold on. Basic math, 71, that's 71. Yeah, in six minutes, I farmed up se in se 71 titanium. That ain't that that ain't too shabby, honestly. And plus it only took me like three minutes to get down here. I mean it's gonna take it'll probably take me it's gonna take me longer to get back up. But I mean just to drop down a bunch of holes. <laughs> that was quick. 71 titanium and let's say an average of 10 to 15 minutes for a little bit of variance there. I mean that's not bad. <laughs> Especially considering your other options are to look for it or to run around and get a bunch of outcrops, which nobody wants to do. Yep. Shot us out right here at the Delta Station dock. Okay, let's go ahead and put on, put on one multi-purpose room. Okay, and I'm actually going to put a second one next door. That may sound kind of silly, but I, but I am going to. Just because I have the titanium now. I'm thinking about doing two rooms of the uh, indoor grow beds. We're good. I'm actually gonna decide later what I'm gonna do this one. I'm gonna put the, the greenhouse on this one first. And then I'm still thinking about taking my large room, making it three stories, and then doubling up my uh, alien contamination. That is still a possibility in my eyes. Okay, last dome. Oh boy, look at that. Okay, let's go get, I got room. I got room for more titanium. Now, if I had quartz, I'd just honestly make a, a hatch. I need to make another, I need to make more hatches. There's only one, there, I guess there's technically three entrances, entrances to my base right now. Um, and two of them are moon pools. Two ladders on top of each other, is that, is that a, kind of a pain in the butt? I'm gonna do another one right here. Yep. Yes, I am. Okay. Oh man, look at that. Okay, so let's go plant these. 
these right here. Always have some potatoes ready to go. Give, like, gave me the leaf. I don't want the leaf though. Yeah, I need the I need the fruit. Four of them. Can you give me four of them? Yes. Okay. And then we got these nuts. Okay. Looking pretty good. We got some stuff planted now. I don't know how much other stuff we need to plant, but that's kind of all I got on hand right now. Um, I may leave these here for now, but I think eventually I'll probably take them out. Okay, let's go store the titanium that we got. Because, I mean, we, we have a ton of it now. I may have to make another container for all of it, because I still have a bunch in the uh, prawn as well. Yeah, we're, we're, we're full up. I need somewhere else to put this. Going in with fish for right now. So we're, we're going to head down to Shadow Boy now. I think I'm going to take the sea truck because I do have the defense grid stuff. And I think that will be helpful. Third time venturing down here. The first two did not go so hot. I guess the first one wasn't that bad. I just chickened out. And the second time definitely didn't go so hot. Let's, let's try and be sneaky. There definitely is a bunch of quartz down here. Yeah, there you are. I still, I still want to bet money, which I don't know this for sure. Um, that there are two. I, I think there's two of them. Oh, come on. Keep it going. Okay, we are in the next area. It is murky. What is that? I want to say we're safe down here, but I don't know. What is it? gold? Damn, I may mine that up. We're going to take this opportunity. Aboard, Captain. We're going to grab this kyanite. And we're going to grab that gold. I don't know if I honestly need more kyanite. But it wouldn't hurt to have it. There's nothing down here? I just found a little pocket. Oh, you got my hopes up. Just another little cavern with a ton of kyanite. <laughs> Am I going to need that for something? With the amount of it that it's here, I got a feeling I'm going to need that for something. Alan's body going to require like 30 of it. Oh no. Oh no, he's right there. Yep. Nope. Get out of here, you little shit. Yeah, how'd that feel? Sucker. That felt good. <laughs> that felt real good. Oh man, to give him that zap. You coming for me now? Yeah, you are. Bring it on. Yeah, get to going. Damn, I should have brought extra power cells. A little worried about that right now. It's changing. We're getting red. Oh man, what is this place? What is this place? I have a, this this has to be where I'm supposed to be going, right? Oh my God! There's another one down here. How many of these things are there? There was only two ghost leviathans in the Forgotten River, or whatever it was called. A substantial facility in the area, unable to identify. Oh no, it's too late. Oh, it's too late. Get back. No, it's too early. Not too late. I really would like to pull my sea truck in. I don't I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that, am I? Can I what where where's safe? 
Where is safe at? What is this? Copper. I'm at least gonna bring my prawn in though. Welcome aboard, Captain. Can I not? Oh my god, I can't bring my prawn in. I swear to god, if this guy kills he heals them. This I'm... is the fabrication facility where we will construct my next form. We must first locate all the necessary components. You should focus on that. You didn't even know what this place was, but you're telling me what to focus on? I am trying to encourage you. Shit. We're too early. Architect skeleton. Oh, okay. So we're going to need, we're going to actually need stuff with them as well. Shit. So is there nothing down here other than that? Um, I think we need to explore a little bit. Hold on, beacon. Beacon, beacon, beacon. Um... Little Allen factory. Oh, shit. Bugged him out a little bit there. Thank God. Thank God I was here. Because it see, he probably would have attacked it if I wasn't out here as well. God, is there really nothing else down here other than this place? Nope. Did I just... No, he's still there. Okay. Okay. So... Damn, there's another one. How many of these little assholes are around here? And I, I refuse to believe that there's not a body part down here. It may not be in this section. But he did mention... He did mention... I mean... He, he mentioned something up in the Crystal Caverns. So let's go back up there and see if we can find it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. Cause yeah, I don't, I don't know where else one would be. So I'm assuming there's one up on land on that next base we need to go to, uh, the robotics facility. Um, I think it's what the map called it. Something like that. So there, yeah, there has to be something down here. There is definitely something of value nearby. It could help you build my body. Yeah, this is... This has got to be something, right? Looks like Superman's Fortress of Solitude. Oh, there we go. There we go. I actually turn my lights back on. Huge. Okay, okay, okay. We making progress. After we got to that last base and he was like, no, we're not ready for this yet. I was, I mean, a little, a little defeated for a second. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> this was your idea. Ah, oh, we got the skittery little jerks. What? The hell am I looking at? Wait, is that it? You will be able to construct bionic organs with the scanned material, both primary and secondary. Our designs provide for redundancies. Given your current location, I think they could still be improved. Your feedback has been noted. That's it? I came all the way down here for a picture? Eh, two body parts down at least. So that's a win. Okay. Get the hell out of this hell hole. I'm not coming back here until we're ready to build his body. Oh man. That has to be it down here, right? Okay. What's we up, Alan? Found two of the three components required for the construction of my corporeal form. 
This is as close as I have come to autonomy in a long time. You have such a way with words. Is that sarcasm? It was. You're learning. Hopefully, I will not have time to complete my study. <laughs> I was wondering, if you can transfer bodies, why was it important to find a cure when you were infected? Couldn't you just make a new body? As you can see in the components you have scanned thus far, the forms we require combine biological and mechanical parts. The tissues you have scanned were developed from the DNA of 27 separate alien species. 27? That seems greedy. And wouldn't that mean that anything that infects a body you've manufactured can potentially learn how to infect all those other species? Yes. That is why a cure was imperative. Huh. Cool, I'm lost. <laughs> How the hell do I get out of this place? Does anyone see a gas station I can stop for directions? Sorry, Mr. Fishy. Wait, we can get down here from Marguerite? Oh, we can! I remember that now. When we found her base, we actually went down there a little bit and I noticed... Okay, good to know. Good to know. Plus, it puts us right where we need to be, unlike the other spot. We're back up in open water. Oh, man, what a mess. I mean, third time was the charm. We did go down there. We found, I'm assuming, what are the only two places that matter down there that don't have a mouth. Um, so we did get the organs. So that's fantastic news. And then we also found the factory we need. Or when uh, we got to make Alan's body, so that was a, that was actually probably uh, the more exciting find because I won't have to be searching for that later on when I need to be. Um, yeah, that's that's good freaking news. Okay, we made it back safe and sound somehow. But next episode, we are going to go up on land. I think it's on land. I mean, from the map, it, it shows that it's on land. Welcome aboard, Captain. We're going to go to the west and try and find this robotics factory. I'm not quite sure where that is, but on the map, it shows west. So we're just going to go west and then see where that takes us. Uh, but yeah, pr pretty, aboard, Captain. pretty good episode. We kind of, we got some stuff done. Well, that's weird. I'm walking around. There you go. Um, but yeah. So, thanks for tuning in, everyone. Hit that thumbs up button if you enjoyed the episode. Hit that subscribe button if you would like to see what happens next in Subnautica Below Zero. I hope everyone has a fantastic day. I will see you all in the next one. Take it later.